Yo and what's up young people, what's up youth, Bavis MC here again, NBS Youth Voice with a big one. Bad one, star early cuts, yeah? Yeah, so today we are here for technology. First tell me brother, mm. do you know chat GPT? You don't know chat GPT? Sound you teach me, you know, I was all waiting for you because you guy. You uh, love technology. Uh, ah, no, for, guy, I technology. I got your technology. Uh, technology. So, since we came at uh, Planet Systems, mm -hmm. yeah, I want you to show me what you know about about technology yeah all right today it's all gonna be about technology and of course we are here at planet systems uh business park nakawa and uh all we're doing we're here to learn yeah we're here to learn and also inspire planet systems is the location and of course today we are talking about technology the youth out there the young people out there all you need to do is make sure you know a little bit of technologies to thrive in the next coming days yeah i personally i know some little bit of technology I know a little bit of AI, and if you ask me how I pass my exams, uh, I don't want to discuss this yet. All right, uh, sometime back, what uh, old Kampala, no, no, not old Kampala, what Kololo says here, yeah? and a student happened to tell me that they used AI to, to create a love song. So I know, how applicable is that in the system you make? Your name and what you do? Right, uh, my name is Kenya Chizaroland, and I'm uh, an AI engineer here at Planet Systems. Yeah, pertaining to the issue of fair doubt, that's very true. There is um, currently we have what you call prompting hearing. Uh, at the moment you use, there is a tool called Sino, Sino.ai. That, that, that tool you can use it to sort of uh, prompt it so that it can generate a song. Write a clear prompt that uh, uh, play for me a song about maybe when you can talk about any name, maybe about. Uh, achieve or any other person so what it does for it it uh, uh research for that's that's one and then you can be able to play it out so right, you said your name is okay that is uh, Roland, yeah uh, which university did you uh pass to? yeah i come from Macquarie university Macquarie university you did ai from there or you happen to add the information that uh, that, uh more education okay, from here also, basically, I studied my AI journey from Macquarie University. Yeah, then I uh, was hired by Brand Systems to undertake the same role for AI engineering. That's why I'm here. Right. So, what are you doing at uh, MOOC? I was doing computer science. Computer science. Yes. All right, so if you're out there and uh, you want to be part of the AI world, I'm sure there's, there's specific courses that you need, yeah, right? Courses like computer science and software engineering. Uh -huh. Yeah, you can also, uh, so long as you have the passion for AI, you can as well come from uh, the arts background and then you can you jump in. Just know that uh, for you to jump into uh, AI, it doesn't require to be a uh, coding wizard. It's just a matter of having some sort of motivation and also uh, being able to push yourself to write code and also to to do to be a fan of the AI. Yeah. Let's talk about the ecosystem of technology. Yeah? I understand uh, there's a lot of uh, you can be you can be a back end uh, developer and a front end developer. Yeah? Then you can be the person who is gonna do uh, the the system uh, security, yeah, which is a part of cyber security. Yeah? So, do you feel like you can be able to have all these in one head, or you need a person to help you out with something else, and that person is also going to connect you to someone else who's going to help you to something else? Yeah, basically, uh, speaking from experience, you can do all because uh, I personally are studying the full stack role, whereby uh, as a front end and also transition to back end. That's where I have I that courage to, to pick up AI, to know how these machines can, how you can instruct a machine to perform a particular task. Take an example of um, maybe you have your AI company at home, like a vacuum cleaner, be instructed to clean it out without your, your supervision. Yeah, so all that, all that courage and all that uh, fun, that's what pushed me to come into the AI. Well, and lastly, what is the greatest project you've worked on ever since you started doing uh, artificial intelligence? Uh, the greatest project so far, I might not be able to expose them, but I can expose one which I'm working on currently here. Uh, one I'm working on currently here is a teller, teller system. I think you've been able to see how we integrate in the computer vision to, to monitor who is clocking in. Yeah. As in back teller, yeah? No, no. 
just tell her. Tell her stands for teachers' effectiveness and learners' achievement. So, oh, okay. I'm stepping on to the next gentleman, another AI engineer here. Uh, what's, my, what's your name? Uh, my name is Albert you are machine learning. Yes, but it's a game. You want to confuse the one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so MLO is basically machine learning operations. All right, so how did you uh, come to be part of the world of machine learning? Yeah, well, my journey, uh, first of all, started with uh, my love for data. So basically, when I ventured into data uh, analysis and uh, engineering, I went later to love for data science. And uh, when you get into data science, you eventually transition into intelligence okay there's a lot to uh, know about machine learning concerning household yeah what what do you, what's your say on uh, the scale on the next ai that you know ai is, is growing yeah and okay first of all do you have a fear for ai in future that it might teach itself to do the to do the things you've been teaching it yeah definitely we need to also be cautious about uh, the adoption of AI and its usage in the world, and that is why we need to uh, legal provisions to come up with the regulations to make the decisions. But uh, basically, there will always be uh, scenarios where there is, uh, I would call. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, let, let us now jump in. Let's, let's first get a remainder. Uh, no. yeah. House household appliance, yeah. The it's it's uh, it's called auto AI, yeah. Okay. Yes. What what do you know about the next smart house? Yeah. So now when you talk about household artificial intelligence, uh, we're most likely going to venture into IoT. So it's going to be what is IoT? Oops. IoT is the Internet of Things. Okay. So basically, this is uh, interaction of uh, your household gadgets. So if you have a smart fridge, you have a, a smart microwave, and then you have your TV, and then you have your, let's say, um, speaker. So machine learning comes into this ecosystem in such a way that uh, it easily detects uh, the trends in a household business. So let's say if you went into the house, and the room temperature can affect the house. Machine learning algorithm automatically now activates it in the heat. So when you go into your heater, then activates, let's say, the heat. Then activates your microwave by you know, magnified the All right, let's, let's send a message to, uh, I, want to I don't want to say that the woman is, <laughs> but I, I feel like yeah, there's, yeah. There's, there's lots of things that have been uh, refusing. Okay, there have been very many walls for AI. For it to develop, most especially in Africa, yeah. First of all, my religion, second of all, uh, the ideology of people being so much uh, the negative, yeah, towards AI's development, yeah. What picture do you want to draw for how simple it's going to be after people adopt to AI? Well, I believe it's going to be straightforward. Uh, first of all, AI is here to stay, and uh, it's the way in my house. The best we could do is adopt it. Then it will all day-to-day -day activities. And uh, for example, we here at uh, Planet Systems are an example of the software development team. We've had claims that uh, software, so the AI is going to be doing that as well. We are a Planet System. Like not. Exactly. Yeah. So we are Planet Systems really incorporating AI into our day-to-day -day activities. And uh, we have some automated uh, coding assistance. So, I believe in our audience, as we All right, uh, doctors, lawyers, uh, businessmen, uh, there's, there's so many people that want to do so many different things. But my only word out there is that everything is now requiring technology yeah? so if you don't have technology in it you might fail to be the next person to sustain yourself in future uh, small small things like technology yeah so uh, we are here still a planet systems and of course uh, we want to uh, see up the room want to see up the room what what the music what the music
Someone play the beat, someone play the beat. I would like to request the AI engineers to join me in the ladies. Yeah, where is our DJ? Where is our DJ? Alright, as you join me as the DJ is coming through, yeah. We do we do this one challenge, yeah. Then uh we make it call it a day, yeah. Alright. We need some energy, yeah. Yeah, it's over seat. Next, a lady here. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? Or something. What inspires you working at the moment? I want to buy future for my Okay. Something. Same goal. Okay. Next, tell what inspires you dressing like what gets you so much. Do you have anyone you look up to according to the style? Person dresses well for you. Not at all. Just my soul. Just you. Yeah, just so selfish. Okay. What uh, what's your favorite food? Favorite food. What school did you pass through? <laughs> high school. High school. High school I went to Memorable side. What, what are they? Yeah, what are these? Show my talk, your eyes. It will depend on that. Yeah, that's why. That's yeah. why you still like, still like fashion. Yeah. Didn't have enough of it. <laughs> Hello. Hello. How are you? Okay. Your name? Helen. Helen. You also do uh, submit. So. All right. Uh, tell me more about Planet Assistant. People <coughs> want or should know about them. And uh, we did in technology like people use technology. So anyone out there who's interested in the technology world, the AI world, do you use What's it about? <laughs> it's, it's fine, but you see, me personally, I use ChatGPT at campus, yeah. Some some good things, not even just bad. What is the craziest thing you've done uh, with ChatGPT? If it was married, what did he tell you? It's a, it's a machine, like I'm a machine, so I do not have emotions, I do not have feelings. Well, right, let's let's head to our DJ. Good man, how are you? Good. You good? Your name? Uh, Jason. Jason. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Uh, do you know Meta Yeah. You know, you know the, the Meta on WhatsApp. Yes. What is the craziest thing you've ever asked it to do? Uh, to design my name on the chat. To design your name on the chat. Yeah. Did you give me the comparisons? Yeah, to give me. You sure? Yeah, well, let, let us demonstrate. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, first, get closer. Get closer. First, get us to uh, WhatsApp. Then, you go to the meta. But you know, there are very many people that don't know this feature on WhatsApp. People don't know that WhatsApp has an AI feature. Yeah? You are requested. Yeah? Just request it. Tell it, uh, say, imagine. Imagine a young boy called Jason. Called Jason at Planet Systems. So very many people actually don't know this feature on uh, on uh, WhatsApp. It's on WhatsApp. It's on Instagram. Uh, and uh, I feel like people need to know what this can actually do. Yeah, it's, it's quite an entertaining uh, entertaining feature if you have it. You, if in case you've been as uh, you've been left on blue tick, you can uh, have something to do. Okay, you send. All right, get ready with the image. Three, two.
to one. It's taking long. Generated. So this is an imagination of uh, a boy called Jason. <laughs> boy called Jason uh, working at Planet Systems, yeah? So I feel like this, this should be put somewhere, yeah? On your desk, yeah? yeah. You feel me? Anyway, we are at uh, Planet Systems, and of course, it's all about technology. The world is moving to technology. If you're not moving with us, I don't think you're going to be part of us in the future. We're the coolest kids of Kampala, and of course, chilling with us is going to need you to step up, step to our level, and our level requires a lot, a lot. Yeah, we are still at Planet Systems, and of course, um, I'm with the COO, uh, a great lady. And I would love her to give us an exploration of the place, give us an exploration, basically an exploration of Planet Systems. Thank you. Um, as earlier introduced, uh, Planet Systems is a nice city and innovations company. We've been on the market for 20 years now, and uh, we have been uh, uh, developing and integrating performance management solutions for various sectors, be it private, be it government, and any uh, parastatal. Uh, we have five departments here. And our staff comprise of innovators, analysts, marketers, and system support teams. Uh, we have over 40 staff. And this also um, help the youth and interns uh, to learn how to harness the emerging technologies about Internet of Things, uh, sensors, and AI. All right, that is one uh, great exploration of Planet Systems. But take home is that our Planet Systems is not just a place, a, a workplace, it's also an academy. Yeah? So if, you are, if you're out there and you need some uh, simple, simple uh, education, uh, 